T'was the night before Christmas, and all through the house. Not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care, in hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. The children were nestled, all snug in their beds. Visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. And Ma in her kerchief, and I in my cap, had settled our heads for a long winter's nap. When out on the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave the luster of midday to the objects below. When what to my wondering eye should appear, but a miniature sleigh and a tiny reindeer. With a little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be Saint Nick. More rapid than eagles, his course as they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. I'm Dasher. I'm Dasher, Prancer, Donner, Pitsy. I'm Cupid. I'm Comet. I'm Cupid. I'm Donner. I'm Lucy. From the top, top of the, of the porch, porch to the top of the wall, now dash away, dash away, dash away, dash away all. As dry leaves that before the wild hurricane fly, when they meet with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the housetop, the coursers they flew, with a sleigh full of toys, and St. Nicholas too. And then in a twinkling, I heard on the roof, the prancing and pawing of each little hoof. As I drew my head and was turning around, down a chimney, St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur, from his head to his foot, and his clothes were tarnished with ash and soot. A bundle of toys he flung on his back, and he looked just like a peddler, opening his pack. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples, how merry. His cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the beard of his chin was as white as the snow. The stump of a pipe he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke encycled his head like a wreath. He had a broad face and a round little belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. He was jolly and plump, a right jolly old elf, and I laughed when I saw him, in spite of myself. With the wink of his eye and twist of his head, I soon knew that I had nothing to drink. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work, then filled all the stockings and turned with a jerk. And laying his finger aside of his nose, and giving a nod up the chimney he rose. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle, and away they all flew, like the down of the thistle. But I heard him exclaim, ere he drove out of sight. Merry Christmas to 